Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Our update for Friday, May 29th, 2020. Got another free pick from the KBO, Korean Baseball Organization, coming up for early Friday morning action. We'll get to that. Hey, first a quick note, we swept again in the KBO, our free pick, our premium pick. We swept again uh, today, early Thursday morning, our second straight sweep. Uh, we're now 12 and two with our four star KBO plays on the season. Not just KBO, but a couple of uh, Taiwan baseball plays mixed in there, but 12 and two in uh, Taiwan and Korean baseball combined. Again, last night, another winner, a runs line winner with NC, they won nine to six. Another free pick winner here. We've been having a great season with our free picks here in Korean baseball. Got another one coming up today, but I wanted to tell you about what's going on for me. Friday morning, Korean baseball, I've got one play over at DocSports.com. It's a nice size play and it's available up until about 12.45 a.m. Eastern time, which is of course 9.45 p.m. Pacific time out here on the West Coast. Uh, that's when the play comes down, but uh, the game goes at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific on Friday morning. It's available right now on my Handicappers homepage over at DocSports.com. Uh, not involved in soccer, any soccer for Thursday. I do, uh, I will be back, I should say, Friday morning with my soccer plays posted at 11.30 a.m. Eastern. That'll be for any late Friday games that I might be involved with and certainly some early Saturday games, so check that out on Friday. Korean baseball, Taiwan baseball, as I mentioned, uh, check for it every single day at 3.30 p.m. Eastern, 12.30 p.m. Pacific. That's when we post our plays for those next early morning games, those next day games. I uh, haven't been involved in Taiwan baseball that much. I had somebody ask me on Twitter, and uh, the reason is, is I base a lot of the CPBL League, the T uh, Taiwan League, off of what happened in their most recent or most recent two outings before I get involved. Starting pitching in that league means almost nothing to me, and you'll know why if you've been following that league, but there's been so many rainouts over the past week. Boy, it's like Taiwan, just one postponement after another. And again, we need to see a couple of games to go back and look and see how certain batters have done because starting pitching again means very little to me in Taiwan baseball. It means a lot to me in Korean baseball. We'll get to the free pick in a moment. Uh, we got UFC action going this weekend. I had a big five-star easy winner uh, a couple of weeks ago on May 16th on the last card that we had in UFC. So we'll have that going. It'll be available on Saturday morning at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8 30 a.m. Pacific time. More about that on tomorrow's video. Uh, NASCAR, we're about a half hour away from the scheduled start after being postponed on Wednesday. About a half hour away from that scheduled start as I cut this video. And we've got more NASCAR going on Sunday. Can't wait. They'll be back at Bristol. And uh, you know how much we like Bristol if you've been following me the last 20 plus years with NASCAR. My Bristol plays on Sunday will be available at 11.30 a.m. Eastern time on Sunday. And again, don't forget about the soccer leagues. Uh, we're involved in two or three soccer soccer leagues now and uh, again our next uh, play will be posted on Friday morning at DocSports.com. Let's get to our free pick. Let's look to stay hot in Korean baseball action. Listen, you remember about oh two weeks ago I guess it was when I said that there's going to be a point where we start to look to play on the SK Wyverns. The roster's too good, too talented to be playing as badly as they were to start the season. I mean it's one of the best teams last year in the KBO and they couldn't win a game. Uh, they have gone from a dog to a favorite. Now I see them anywhere from a buck 15 favorite to a buck 35. So certainly shop around the plant Hanwha. Uh, but I like the matchup. Listen, the starting pitching matchup for Hanwha and for SK on Friday morning is pretty even, but that's about it. If you look at what SK has done of late, uh, they're three and five in their last eight games. Uh, they got a nice win over uh, Dusan last time out. But three and five in the last eight, much better than they were doing earlier in the season. They are a grand total of just six runs away from being seven and one in their last eight games rather than three and five. So you can see this team starting to come around. They're playing extremely close baseball games and they're starting to come out ahead uh, every couple of games. Well, against Hanwha, I think they can win the series. Now, as far as Hanwha is concerned, they've lost five in a row. Playing the worst baseball in the KBO right now as we speak. Not only have they lost five in a row, but unlike SK, who's starting to show signs of coming around, Hanwha was outscored 34 to 6 
during that five game losing streak. Horrible. Basically seven to one per game average that they're getting outscored. We like what SK is doing. We think that's a pretty even starting pitching matchup. But after that, when we get the pins, uh, when we factor in offense, Hanwha being the lowest scoring team in the league, we're going to see another SK win. We agree with that movement on SK. So our free pick for early Friday morning KBO action, the SK Wyverns. Don't forget about my Korean baseball premier play for Friday morning over at Doc Sports right now. It's available till 12.45 a.m. Eastern time for Friday morning action. Hope you like these videos. If you do, click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. We'll be right back here Friday between 8 p.m. Eastern and 10 p.m. Eastern with the report for Saturday. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com.